Jefferson Barracks National Cemetery in St. Louis is the final resting place of over 188,000 service members and family. The grounds are a somber yet beautiful memorial to those who served our country with honor, many who died in battle. And when our heroes are laid to rest, you'll often find the American Legion family there to pay tribute. One such group is a color guard composed of ALA members of Unit 253 in Festus, Missouri. Practice makes perfect, as witnessed by this dress rehearsal inside Post 253. Unit 253 saw an opportunity to serve, and they acted. The cemetery at Jefferson Barracks has tasked us with quite a lot. We found it to be a blessing to have our auxiliary assist us with those funerals. The Color Guard rifle detail fires three shots at funerals representing duty, honor, and country. And taps is played with a ceremonial bugle. When speaking to anyone on the team, pride and honor are the overwhelming takeaways. I'm proud to be on the Color Guard to give our veterans their final call. It is such an honor to help serve the veterans of our post and our nation. As part of the American Legion Auxiliary, I am so proud to be a part of our Color Guard team. And we couldn't be prouder of the Color Guard team from Unit 253 in Festus, Missouri. About 150 miles east in Flora, Illinois, Another auxiliary team honors our flag and country in a different way. The Shooting Stars, an all ALA junior member drill team and color guard, performs precision moves and presents our nation's colors at special events and competitions. The Shooting Stars drill team started around eight years ago. We started with kindergarten and first graders, and we still have three of the original ones with us. Love of country is taught from the beginning. All the girls are American Legion Auxiliary Junior members of Unit 14, Flora, Illinois. The girls learn a lot about patriotism, discipline, and teamwork. I've been teaching drill team for many, many years, but this drill team is very special to me. We meet once a month, we practice for four hours as hard as we can, because that's what it takes to make a national championship team and their hard work paid off, capturing top honors in the open class competition at the 2016 National Convention in Cincinnati. I couldn't believe when we won first place at Cincinnati. It was exciting. The shooting stars competed in the open class and won the national title. With a score of 88.35, the shooting stars color guard from American Legion Post 14, Flora, Illinois. And you can imagine the surprise we had when we got back to Flora after winning our national championships in Cincinnati, when the streets were filled with the people of Flora welcoming us home with our championship trophy. There are other rewards besides trophies and congratulations. I love being in the Shooting Stars drill team. It's a lot of fun and we get to travel. I've been in drill team since kindergarten. I've learned leadership, responsibility, and teamwork. I am so proud to be in the Shooting Stars drill team. The Shooting Stars recently competed at the 2018 National Convention in Minneapolis. Wouldn't it be great if we won again? And win again they did! Congratulations to the 2018 Open Division National Champions, the Shooting Stars of Flora, Illinois. And we're all ALA proud of all the drill teams, color guards and honor guards throughout the American Legion Auxiliary.